what's up guys welcome back to Drew tutorial and in today's video i am going to show you how to compress large video files using the vlc media player now as you can see i have my vlc media player open here and if you don't just go ahead click on the windows icon on the taskbar and either type the vlc or either type vlc player or you know basically if you have it on your desktop you can open it now once you open up the vlc player guys in order to compress those videos you simply want to click on media on the uppermost left hand side and you want to click on convert slash save now here on the files you want to click on add and from here you can go ahead and find that video file that you want to compress now i'm going to go ahead and find some video file that i've recorded as you can see the first one here 66 megabyte the second one here is about 25 megabyte 8 and the third one here is 15 megabyte i'm going to use the one with the smallest in terms of minutes so this one is about 25 megabytes so i'm going to click on this and simply click and open now once this is open you will be able to see that it's added here within the vlc media player and all you have to do now is just simply go ahead and click on convert slash save and this will open up the section where you can choose what kind of file format you want so here you have the h plus mp3 which the output is going to give you the mp4 you have the webm you have the ts you have the mp4 as well with the h265 so you can go through it and you can choose now i'm going to choose the first one guys this video file right here and here at the bottom it says destination file this allows you to choose where you want this to save so i'm going to choose for example my downloads here and i'm going to give my file a name so i'm going to say converted video and as you can see it will turn out to be an mp4 so i'm going to simply click save and then i'm going to click start now keep in mind that the vlc player is going to convert this video it will take some time depending on the length of your video as you can see mine is moving pretty fast so we just need to allow it it's time to compress the video I don't know to be honest how much smaller this will be but i've had the experience where i've converted video over 300 megabytes and this video turns out to be almost 100 megabytes less right so let's see how this will turn out to be it's almost finished now as you can see it is done so what i'm gonna do i am going to go ahead and show you the previous file so as you can see here this file was 25.8 megabytes right so let me go to downloads and see what the vlc convert this one to be and as you can see it does a massive job by converting that from 25.8 megabyte to 5.86 megabyte how amazing is that it actually does a massive good job and in terms of quality i must say it doesn't take anything from that and as you can see here i have the recorded video that i converted using the vlc media player so it is there the video is working the quality looks really nice and yeah vlc does a really good job with converting video and also compressing them really nicely 